You're welcome back to News Desk, and we're going over now to Kofroidia, where there's the National Science and Maths Quiz uh, competition, a contest taking place. Maxwell Agogba is there for joining us. Hello, Maxwell. So, which contest is this? Which are the schools participating? Maxwell, you have to mute. Um, Israel, yeah. So, the first contest, um, we have Ghana Senior High School um, in that particular contest. We also have Okay Payment Senior High School and then um, Savia Senior High School. Um, we are in round two right now. Round two is actually over. What is happening right now in the auditorium um, behind me um, is round three. So round three is ongoing problem uh, of the day. But as it stands right now, Ghana Senior High School is leading um, contest with just um, five points. They took an early lead um, in the first round. That Okoye Payment Senior High School managed um, to close um, the gap um, as it stands right now to just five. We're waiting to see um, round three, which is the problem of the day, ha has 10 points. So we're waiting to see um, if Ophir Payne Senior High School will be able to again close the gap and then catch up um, with the uh, uh, um, opponent, um, the guys from Ghana Senior High Secondary School. Xavier Senior High School has a sense right now, not really in the contest, but also um, doing very well, proving to be um, a force to work with. Now, the second contest. For the day, we have a Quaterman School, we have Manek over Senior High School, we create a Prezi Senior High School. Third contest, we have Empire City Senior High School, the Dwarfa State College, and then the VBM Zion SHS. But in the auditorium itself, um, the place is filled um, by students from the Ghana Senior High School. A lot of them um, in there, um, they are all students that are also um, in there, giving them all the, um, the needed support. All students of European Senior High School are also in there, giving them all the moral support that they need. Uh, to qualify to the one age stage of the competition. After interacting with quite a number of students um, who are here, and they tell me that it is their dream to actually um, go to Kumasi, where the one age stage of the competition will be taking place, the one age stage, the quarterfinals, the semifinals, and the grand finale itself. What it means is that if they are able to win this particular contest, they will be able, um, they will qualify to the next age, which is the one age stage. If they are not able to a win, then it means that um, they'll drop out and hope and hope that they'll be part of the uh, top 50 schools with highest points, uh, you know, to move on to the next stage of the competition. So many of the students here are very hopeful. The uh, former students are also hopeful that, I mean, they would qualify um, to the next stage of the competition. But as I speak to you, students of uh, the BBM Zion um, SHS just arrived here on the ground in their yellow bag and then um, in their yellow uh, um, polo shirts as well. We are waiting to get inside. Their contest uh, will be the third contest um, for the day, Israel. But would you know if the schools for the, the second contest are already in place? No, Maxwell, I'm asking if you would know if the schools that will be taking part in the second contest, that's Okwapman School and the others, are already on the premises. Uh, uh, sorry, Israel, can you can I go to you? I'm asking if the schools that will be taking part in the second contest, that's Okwapman School, Manya Krobo and in Quetia Press BSHS, if they're already there on the premises. Exactly. Um, while we were in there in the auditorium, I saw um, students from the Quap One Senior High School uh, arriving here on the ground. A lot of them are looking very happy, quite optimistic that we're going to call it the fact to this um, one eighth age of the competition. In fact, I interacted with one of the teachers and he says that we are really um, poised for action. And they believe strongly that they're going to make it to Kumasi at the one age stage. Many of them also partly want to get us to that stage because um, that is the part where the, comp the, the competition actually gets more competitive. Yeah. So there are more eyeballs starting to the one age stage, which is the um, elimination stage. And the price target also from the one age stage, the elimination stage, starts getting bigger. So really, if you want to project the image of your school, if you want... Um, your school to enjoy the bars that comes to the National Science and Math quiz competition, it has to be from the elimination stages. The preliminary stages, yes, there's a lot of competition there, not so many eyeballs. But from the elimination stage, which is the one end stage, the quarterfinals, the semifinals, and the grand finale, that is where the eyeballs will be. And that is what many of the people have been interacting with um, uh, are yearning for. That is the stage they want to get to, and they want to make a difference from that stage. Much, uh, Maxwell, I'm going to bring you the source update from Kofroidia, and we will keep you uh, posted.
but the broadcast of uh, the National Science and Maths Quiz is brought to you by Joy News and it's supported by Carbell, Papa's Pizza, and uh, Dole, DBS, and Tampico. It's also uh, supported by Ace Medical Insurance. We're taking a break. We're bringing you business news next.